Say hi, puppy. Pup, say hi. Say hi to the camera. Say hi to the camera. You wanna go back in your kennel? <laughs> Was that a no? Stop. Hey, 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 hey. Stop it. Stop acting out for the camera, Blue. Stop. y'all welcome back to my youtube channel so <laughs> i was trying to do the dog tag with blue over here but he got in trouble so now he has to be in this kennel because he acting up for the camera he's trying to show off for his little friends and i don't got time for that but yes this is blue my dog blue he's mad at me right now blue say hi to the camera <laughs> he's so irritated but yeah today i'm going to be doing i don't even have my phone i'm gonna get my phone real quick okay but yes i'm going to be doing the dog tag today with blue when he's done acting up because my mom just came home from work and he acts crazy when my mom comes home from work and she went upstairs to take a shower and he can't go upstairs. So he kind of got upset with me because I, I blocked off the steps and so now he can't go upstairs. So he has an attitude with me right now, but that's okay. We'll be friends in a minute. <laughs> Does that mean no? <laughs> Blue, are you not going to be my friend anymore? Now he's giving me the silent treatment. Let me let him out so he can join us on our, on our fun journey of answering questions. Okay, Blue, are you ready to come out? Okay, here we go. He has to stretch before he comes out. Stop! Ooh, he acting stink. outside because he had to blow off some steam he was losing his mind a little bit now he's over there drinking water I think okay so let's go ahead and get into this dog tag <laughs> okay there are 10 questions on the dog tag the first question is what is your pet's name blue that is his name blue cheese Callaway we spell it B L E U like blue cheese not like the color <laughs> and he we got his the, his name because the litter that he was 
born into or whatever like the breeder he named them after after the color of the collar they had on so he had a blue collar so his name was blue and he wanted to like remix it a little bit so he just changed it into blue cheese <laughs> number two what kind of pet is it and what breed okay he's, he's a dog i don't know if you guys can hear him but he's eating right now um oh he's a rhodesian ridgeback if he comes over here i'll show you guys the bridge on his back not all rhodesian ridgebacks have ridge, ridges though but he does a lot of them do, but not many of them do. And this is our third dog, and we've only had Rhodesian Ridgebacks. Like, the first dog was a girl. Her name was Honey. Then the second dog we had was Sunny. And then now we have Blue. I don't know it's like, Honey. Actually, we had another dog, Halo, which was, and he was a, um. Honesty! What kind of dog was Halo? Oh, yeah, a Rhymer Reiner. That's what. Halo was. <laughs> I mean, we thought he was so cute when we had him, but I, I was looking back at, the, back at the pictures and I was like, dang, he was low-key kind of ugly. <laughs> but yeah, Blue's, Blue's way cuter than, than Halo, but we've had, we've only had one of these We only had Halo for like two weeks and we got rid of him because he was, he was a mess. Okay. He was a hot mess. And then we got Blue after Halo. He's a Rhodesian Ridgeback, a liver nose, because the dog we had before, Sunny, he was a... Rhodesian Ridgeback, but he was a black nose Rhodesian Ridgeback, which is a big difference. Question number three. How long have you had your pet friend? I don't like that they call it a pet friend. That's weird. But um, we've had him for almost two years, like a year and a half now. We got him in like August. Like August. Yeah, that's when we got him. Question number four. How did you get your pets? Uh, Blue actually was like shipped not really shipped but like <laughs> he came he, he came i cannot speak today he came from texas like his breeder lives in texas and then he flew here technically so we picked him up from the airport <laughs> in his little kennel or whatever and he was so small he was so cute i mean he's still kind of cute now but i wish he'd come over here i don't know why he's being so distant blue come here pop He literally just turned the other way. That was so rude. Question number five. <laughs> How old is your pet? Blue is a year old and some change. I don't know. <laughs> His birthday's in June, so he's he's a year old, but like plus some. Oh, here he comes. Here he comes. Oh, now you want to come over? No, -uh, don't eat that. Stop. Question number six. What is your favorite memory with your pet? Hmm, I don't know. Blue, he was eating and then when I called him, he just stopped eating. Um, I think my favorite memory with Blue would have to be when we went to uh, Mount Baker. Not last Christmas, but the Christmas before last. We took him with us to a snow resort. And he had his little vest on and he was super cute, you know, and he... He was just like, you know, walking in the snow. I don't know. It's just super cute. I don't know. And he actually pushed me down in the snow, like physically. Like he actually pushed me into the snow. So, you know, I guess that's probably our, our favorite memory together. But you have to ask him yourself. <laughs> Let's take a little break. Let's go see what Blue's doing because I don't, he's being a little rude today. Actually, I think he's just really hungry. Blue, let's see. What were you eat? What are you eating? Oh, you barely have any food left. Is it good? Hey, Blue, you want to go sit down with me? Come on, let's go sit down. Come. Let's sit. He's here, the star of the show. Do you have anything to say, Blue? Ah, uh, me too, man. Sit. Good puppy. Good puppy. Now we have a complete show. <laughs> He's so rude. He just puts his butt in my face. <laughs> but yeah, he can sit and he can shake. You guys want to see him shake? Let's see if we can get him to shake. Come here, Blue. Puppy. Come here. Sit. Good puppy. Good puppy. Look at him sit. Okay, shake. Good puppy. Good puppy. You did such a good job. I don't have a treat for you. Here. Your knuckle. There you go. 
All right. Oh, and he dropped it. <laughs> and he left it. All right. Yeah, that's pretty much all he can do. <laughs> Sit and shake. I mean, he knows how to go to his kennel, too. If I tell him to go to his kennel, he'll go inside of it. Here we go. Puppy, go to your kennel. Kennel. Kennel, go. And in he goes. Good puppy. Okay. Okay. Okay, come on. Okay, come on. Good puppy. Oh, okay. I don't want to kiss. I don't want to kiss. I just want to say good job. Okay, I, he, he's, he's really over me now. <laughs> Let's go back to our questions, guys. Got a little sidetrack there. All right, question number seven. What are some quirky things about your pet's personality? Well, where do I begin? <laughs> well, let's see. What's one of the quirky things? Well, first, he has like a nervous lick that he does. Like, and it's really, really dramatic for no reason. Like when he's in trouble or like he knows he's this, like he did something that he wasn't supposed to do. He'll lick like really aggressively. Like he'll like, especially this table right here. He always licks this table just like, like really aggressively and it's, it's kind of annoying. I don't even know. And then like sometimes he'll come and look us like on the legs and stuff and on our hands. And it's really, it's too much. Like it's too much. Blue, you better not be eating anything. But yeah, not like a normal lick, but it's kind of more of a really aggressive lick. I don't know what that's about. Another weird, I guess not a part of his personality, but like, I don't know if you guys noticed when he was just in here, but he has one really cute ear, like one that's like super flat and then one that's like way back here <laughs> and it's super ugly and we, we call that his ugly ear. And when he was younger, we tried to tape his ears down because my mom read somewhere online that if you tape, if you tape your dog's ears down that it like helps them like stay like this, like, you know, the cute puppy ears. So we tried taping them down and I think it worked for... I don't know who he's barking at, but it worked for a minute. And then now it, now it's just this one ear. That's just like, it's super ugly. I don't know. And then when he's super stressed out or like when he's in trouble, both of them are just like, they're like all the way back. Here. <laughs> they're, they're rarely ever like this. Like it's hard to get a picture of him like that. But yeah, that's, I guess it's not really a part of his personality, but like, uh, oh, another thing, like when he goes to poop, like right, we always know, like when we put him in the backyard, we always know he just pooped because he'll like run back and forth. Like he runs super fast after he gets done pooping. I don't know what's that, what's that about, but like, I guess, I guess, my mom said that he just feels like, he feels like a lot lighter after he poops. So he'll go poop and he's just like, pew, 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 and he just zooms back and forth. And I'm just like, I guess, oh, he hears me talking about him. I don't know. Yeah, he, he does that. <laughs> I, I can I honestly can name a whole bunch of things about Blue. Like he's he's my best friend. People let me tell you about my best friend. He's a warm-hearted person who loves me till the end. <laughs> but yeah, uh, let's go on to our next question. Question number eight. What does your relationship with your pet mean to you? Um. Honestly, Blue is my brother. Actually, sometimes I call him my brother, sometimes I call him my son, you know, either or, you know. <laughs> He's a part of the family, okay? He is like my Ace Boon Coon. Come here, Ace Boon Coon, come here. Oh, I didn't mean to knock you down. <laughs> there's his ridge, by the way. I don't know if you guys can see it, but there's his ridge right here. And he has a little he had got a punch biopsy done because he was having some he was having some issues. Don't worry about that. He's insecure, okay? Don't look at that. But his ridge is really pretty. <laughs> but yeah, he's having he's he's been having some hair loss right there. So we went to take him to the vets for them to check it out and they just did like a little biopsy. That's all that is. He's getting this just taken out tomorrow. So no biggie, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, that's his ridge. Anyways. <laughs> um what was I going with this? Yeah, blue is like a part of the family, you know. Like he means a lot to me, to be honest. Like I don't know what I'll do without him, you know? I feel like this is getting really sentimental for no reason. <laughs> Let me relax. Okay, question number nine. What are some of your favorite pastimes with your pet? Is that not the same question as what is your favorite memory with your pet? Anyways, what is my favorite pastimes with my pet? Hmm, I'll think of a, no a different scenario. Uh, oh, my legs hurt. <laughs> I had to lower the camera. I couldn't sit on my knees no more. <laughs> But uh, my favorite pastimes with my pet, I would have to say, 
Blue, what do you think? What do you think, Blue? It's like you're thinking super hard about life right now. But, uh, obviously Blue doesn't like, he hasn't had any good times with me apparently because he had nothing to say on that question. <laughs> Favorite pastimes. I'll try to think of another memory that we have together. Oh no, there was one time, it was when he was like a little bit smaller. He was in my room and I have a body mirror in my room and he thought it was another dog. Really Blue? He thought there was another dog in the mirror but it was just him. So he was barking at himself and he, Blue, can you go somewhere? And he thought that <laughs> he thought it was not, I can't, he thought it was another dog in the mirror so he started barking at the dog and then he like lunged at it at the mirror and he broke my mirror and I had to get a new mirror like the screen like not the screen the glass blue stop the screen cracked why do I keep seeing the screen the glass of the mirror cracked and the frame part of it broke off because that was another dog inside the mirror I just thought it was it was super funny because he did it like three days in a row. The first two times, you know, it was harmless. Then the third time, he's like, uh-uh, get this dog out of my house. And he pounced at it, and then he broke my mirror. So it hasn't happened since, though. Like, we have mirrors in the house now. He doesn't, I guess he doesn't see himself anymore. I don't know. He's a vampire, but it doesn't happen anymore. He just, <laughs> he doesn't even look at himself in the mirror anymore. I don't know. I guess he's traumatized. Maybe we should take him to a dog therapist. <laughs> Question number 10, our last and final question. Why did he put this right here? Okay, the last question. What are nicknames that you call your pet? Puppy is the main one, we call him Puppy. Puppy! Look at my big puppy! Look at my big puppy, look at you! You look tired. But yeah, puppy, we call him puppy. And we call him, I don't like when he licks me on the neck. It makes me feel weird. <laughs> but yeah, puppy, or sometimes when we're really mad at him, we like, blue! Blue! <laughs> but yeah, puppy, blue. I don't know if I just offended him or hurt his feelings, but. Uh, now we're just sitting back to back, I guess. But yeah, blue, pup, um, that's pretty much it. We don't really call him anything else. Oh. <laughs> and now he's chasing his tail. <laughs> Are you itchy? guys that is it for this video i don't have any more questions i don't have anything else to say you know he's just a little old dog all right want to say bye say bye look at that both now both is oh that's a good ear right there blue you don't want to say bye don't be rude all right guys me and blue's hiney All right, guys, I wanted to say bye with him, but he's not sitting down with me. I'm gonna see if I can get him to sit down. Come here, Blue. He's so tired of me, like he's tired of me calling him. Blue, come here. If I had a treat, he moves so quickly. Blue him not even moving. Usually he likes to sit on my lap, but now he's being like disrespectful. Come here. He's sniffing the camera. Does it smell good? <laughs> What is the problem? Yeah, he's laying down right here. Okay. Well, we'll just do it like this then with his back to the camera. Because for some reason he's being rude today. Look. No, right there. All right, guys. He, he's being a little stink today. I think he's kind of over the camera. I've worn him out. Want to give him a kiss? Mwah. Mwah. Give him a kiss. Kiss. Ooh, he's so he's so bougie. Okay. 
all right guys thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed watching my dog and learning all about him <laughs> he's still sitting right here by the way we're still bonding but he's just a little tired <laughs> just just a little tired we'll, we'll let him be he needs to take a little nappy poo <laughs> make sure you guys like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video look <laughs> look look <laughs> People let me tell you about my best friend He's a warm-hearted person who loved me till the end People let me tell you about my best